What's up, man? Uh, trying to put this tribute, little tribute cut together. You know what I'm saying for Michael Jr. Uh, little sample from Oliver Sane. You know what I'm saying? I found it. I think it's fitting. You no, know, just gotta try to put it together and uh, we'll see what happens, man. That makes the magic. You know what I mean? For sure, for sure, man. You wish your boy Mac Money narrating this thing, man. I'm behind the camera right now, but definitely gonna spit something, man. Just actual, factual for Michael Ward Jr., man, for real. When this initially happened, friends and family, dozens of them came out to try to figure out exactly what happened. You see right now there is a memorial here where people have left flowers on South Yakima Avenue where Michael Ward Jr. was killed. Ward was shot several times outside an after-hours club early Sunday morning, but there were no clues who the shooter is. Tacoma police tell me it's still unclear whether he was targeted or if he was just at the wrong place at the wrong time. For the first time, we are now hearing from Michael Ward's family, including his mother, who spoke exclusively with King 5's Janet Kim. Here's a little story about a nigga from the streets Born in it, sworn in it, raised to be a G Daddy taught him better, but the hood consumed him Daddy tried to teach him not to fuck with hood friends A young black Hebrew, only if he knew The path that he chose would put him away soon Life goes on and his hustle got strong Caught a couple cases, didn't snitch and came home Back to the block, yeah, back to the set Back to the street dreams, high off the wet Stayed on switches and getting at bitches Used to tell my nigga to watch them niggas Used to tell my nigga to slow down nigga The haters got high too, you know that nigga Michael Jr. Michael Jr. I met him when he was 13, sneaking to the hood, trying to flip that cheese. Knocking on my window at the middle of the night. Flipping half and quarters, getting good on the grind. The hood bangers got him, he wasn't a punk. My nigga always kept the heat on the lap of the trunk. Quick to peel a whip if the rims were hot. Jack a nigga for the sounds if he was that mark. Michael Jr. was a nigga with a big ass heart. Always loved his family and he knew his God. But the elements of hood life, struggle and strife. Pushed a young nigga to be a man and get on the grind. And the fact is the truth is only two ways out. Wish we could have got the nigga before they ran their mouth. Michael Jr. I was just talking to my nigga, man, this life is a trip. Now it's coffee for my nigga. Before my nigga died, Junior told me this. He wanted to have kids but couldn't trust his bitch. He wanted to leave the streets alone but needed the chips. Wanted to get right with Yahweh and study the script. While they was cooking up the switches, man, my nigga had whips. I'ma miss my nigga cousin, that's on crib. Make prayers for the family, especially Zeke. Little nigga Jeffrey, big nut and doobie. Seeing you gotta stay strong and guide the ship. Making prayers to the most high to guide his kids. A father lose a son, man, the pain rolls deep. Rest in peace, Michael Ward Jr. Rest in peace, Michael Jr. That was the worst delivery I ever had in my life. It may be one of the first jokes she's cracked in days. And you guys, guess what? He weighs 4 pounds, 11 ounces. <laughs> <laughs>
parents shouldn't have to bury their children. And I know whoever did this, your day is coming. 